question number 32 a negative a negative charge q is to be moved within a electric field e okay this is the electric field e uniform electric field to equidistant points from its position as shown which path requires the most work done to, to understand this so how do you get an electric field you get an electric field because of charges what kind of charges see if at all in this region if there are lots of positive charges like this then what could have happened this could have given an electric field like this if it was negative charges you would have got a negative electric field like this over here so there's a lot of positive charge here first thing now if you this is negative here if you want to move this negative charge in this direction is it difficult for you it's not at all difficult for you because by default all these positive charges will attract here it's very easy for you so but what is he asking is asking you which path requires the most work done so definitely this is not the answer this is also not the answer because you know you can easily move it now what about here c for c what are you doing here you have to move by an angle okay so definitely you need some work to be done but look at this here d d is asking about most work done which means what it's very difficult to move against the field see if you want to move like this you have to go against the attraction of the positive charge so you need to do a lot amount of work over here so d should be the right answer in fact c also takes but it's not as effective as d here but d definitely takes a very larger value okay so d is the right answer